On the other side, the Sisterhood Foundation will host a wellness seminar for women tomorrow in Randberg in celebration of Women's Month. The organizer of the event, Kanyisi Lechadebeka Kumisa, says she is looking forward to having women come together to share their different experiences in all spheres of life in an effort to empower one another. The Sisterhood Foundation will collaborate with various stakeholders to host a wellness seminar for women in honor of August being International Women's Month. The event organizer Kanyisile says the initiative comes after a string of commemorative activities that highlight the power of women in all significant spheres. We look at connecting one another for business purposes, making sure that our mental health is in check, our sexual wellness and other avenues. So it's a, basically a platform to connect as women and also be able to come into a space, cry, pray together and have that whole thing of removing negativity and insecurity when it comes to women and that whole thing of not competing as women and that, that inferiority complex. So we're trying to remove that whole thing out of that space to make sure that women realize how powerful they are together. Nolutando, who is a businesswoman, adds that she is excited for women to attend and share their business expertise while networking with other important figures. I really, really think the sisterness wellness movement is needed because as women we go through a lot. Mm. Before you're a businesswoman, you're a daughter, mm. you're a wife, you're a sister, you're, you're someone's aunt, you're a niece, you're a woman first. Mm. And I truly advocate for women's wellness, emotional wellness, physical wellness, psychological wellness, every form of wellness before you can be impactful and effective in your business, you need to be okay first. Busi Siwe says this will be a great opportunity for her to showcase her musical skills and is motivated by women coming together for their own empowerment. I mean, as a musician, I just, I grew up uh, being an introvert, you know, because me and Kula, there were no spaces where uh, you, are, you are required not to be uh, perfect, you know. Every time, Tina, as women, we always want to appear as if we, we got this. I, I know what I'm doing, uh, the, I'm not going to take this, blah, 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 you know. So um, you always want to appear perfect. So uh, spaces like this allow you to be yourself. On the day, the foundation will also launch a book titled Broken and Mended, which speaks to the healing of traumas experienced by women in the general society. This initiative will also choose five girls for a mentorship program which will run for the rest of the year. For Soweto TV News, I am Zweli Banzi Mazibugo.